No, this is wrong. I found this exact location of the starting shot in Chicago, USA. But the ending scene is about a thousand kilometers away in New York. So we cannot use geolocation for calculating the speed of the train. We have to go with the reading of speedometer. Now, there are six cars in this train, each weighing around 33 tons with a seating capacity of about 180 people. It took him 50 seconds to stop the train with a stopping distance of 875 meters and a stopping force of about 200,000 newtons. The spider that bit Peter Parker is from a genus called Arrhenius, with silk having a tensile strength of 1.1 gigapascal. There are total 16 strands, 8 of them collectively as thick as Peter's fingers, which can withstand a force of about 7,000 newtons, which is much more than required. The strands won't actually break like this with this provided information. But there is something more incorrect here. Web strands aren't made up of uniform material, so we cannot use stress strain formulas for calculating actual elongation, but they can stretch up to 4 times of their original length before breaking. These buildings, separated by a distance of 20 meters, having 10 meters of web each side, would give a stopping distance of just 38 meters, with the required stopping force of about 4.5 million newtons, which is much more than the maximum limit of a spider web. So the strands won't actually stop the train, and before breaking apart, they would have caused a lot of structural damage to the train and a lot of deaths because the train's body isn't built to bear such enormous pressure. 